Now here is your opportunity. There's the discounted price that brought you in, okay? Now, over here, I'm gonna give you three choices when it comes to the term. Short-term, long-term, mid-term. What's short-term do for you? Saves you money. In fact, in this case, it probably saves you a couple thousand dollars. Allows you to pay it off faster, take the dream payment, no payment at all, and you can trade sooner. Payment's a little bit higher, but it comes with some great benefits. At 75 months, Hey, it's a terrific payment as well. Payment goes way down, but it also provides you financial freedom because you can pay it off early, no prepayment penalty, all right? And at 72, it's sort of the best of both worlds. Now, when it comes to cash down, I got one, two, and 3,000. Let me tell you what cash down does for you. You looking for high payments or low payments? Okay, the yeah. more cash you put down, the lower your payment. The more cash you put down, the more money you save because the balance to finance is smaller. And the more cash you put down, the quicker you can trade it. So, which one of these cash down numbers is going to work best for you? Uh, all I got is 500. We could come up with another five, couldn't we? Or, if you, if, if you only got 500, and we're going to do it your way, um, just, we're just going to add about 10 bucks a month to this column right here. Can we just do that? Maybe. Well, Q, here are your choices. Add $10 to each one of these. All right, long term or short term, save the most money, pay it off quicker, trade sooner. Long term, more comfortable uh, payment, financial freedom to pay it off early, no prepayment penalty, and the best of both worlds. Put a check mark by the one that works best for you and okay it right down there. What about my insurance? You're going to pay your own insurance. We're not going to pay it for you. <laughs> I guess I'd go to 75 months. <laughs> All right. What did I do differently than you guys did? Value. Well, does it make sense? Do we want the customer to give us all the money for the vehicle? Yes. Do we deserve all the money for the vehicle? Yes. Yes, we do. So, I know what some of you are thinking. Well, we would have gone through all of this during the course of the uh, uh, sales process, right? Mm -hmm. Q, does the customer hear everything we say? Not really. Nathan, does the customer retain everything we say? No. If all this is good stuff, by the way, um, is it the right vehicle? Do we want the customer to tell us it's the right vehicle? Mm -hmm. yeah. Do we want to remind the customer it's a better vehicle because it's a certified vehicle? Do we want to reduce their risk? Yes. Look, if I don't think I can pay too much, if I don't think I can get stuck with the wrong vehicle, does it make it easier for me as a customer to say yes? If I don't need to worry about buying somebody else's problem because I've got a six month, 7,500 mile warranty that covers most of the mechanical workings of the vehicle, does it make it easier for me as a customer to say yes? See, that's what we want to do. Look, it's not easy for a customer to say yes to any car salesperson anywhere, unless you're a weird person like I am and buy lots of cars, okay? But most people aren't like me. Most people are normal human beings. It's difficult for them to say yes. That's why so many people walk out. They walk out because they don't want to get stuck with the wrong vehicle. Can it happen here? Yeah. No, no. They can't get, no, they can't get stuck with the wrong vehicle because what do they have the right to do? Exchange. Exchange it. Okay, and again, that's not like a trade-in. Q, how long have you been selling cars? About 2019. Okay, do people worry about paying a car dealer too much? Uh, for the most part. For the most part? Maybe 90% of the time? Yeah. Okay, yeah, look, what are the, what's, what's our reputation? For, are, is the car dealer known for making good deals? Yeah. No, they're not. Ours what's wrong is, with you? Ours is. <laughs> in general, in yeah, general. Yeah, no, it's not that. No, no, we're known for, we're for, no, we're known for ripping people off. Charging too much. Okay, well, it can't happen here. And remember, they don't know you. Okay, unless it's a repeat or a referred customer. They don't know you. Um, roadside assistance, does it have value? Mm -hmm. Does key care have value? Yes. 
So does it make sense to mention all these things? What well, if they ask me, well, 